everybody it's Gil and today I'm gonna maybe show you guys a couple of CDs or something I'm not too sure but my main reason I'm making this video is to see what happens to me when I drink this stuff I got four liters of it to drink so uh, let's see what happens I'm Gil this is my channel if you don't like it turn it off Okay, so I have this stuff that I have to drink, this pig light stuff. I got to drink four liters of it because I'm gonna have a colonoscopy. So of course, when you have a colonoscopy, you gotta get yourself cleared out. That's what this stuff is for. They uh, told me, you know, don't have anything planned for tonight. So, but anyways, I have to drink two liters of this tonight and I gotta drink another two liters of it in the morning before I go. I paid a lot of money for this stuff, so I'm gonna get my money's worth out of it and I thought I'd make a video. You know, I spent more money on this than I would on a record. So I'm gonna share that what I'm opening here is open this pig like stuff. So it says here, refrigerate the solution as chilling improves the taste. And using a straw can help make the solution taste better. This way the solution may go down faster and thus minimize its taste. So they're not really selling it for me here. Um, it's a fruit flavor. So that can't be a bad thing, I think. I don't know. So I'll just mix it up. I'm going to fill it up to the fill line here. Fill it up to this line. Oh my god, it's just, it's still filling. It's going to take forever. I'm a little disappointed. No. Oh, fun color or anything. <laughs> I mean, the, at least they can give me the illusion that it's like a, yeah, it's a, fun, a, drink. a fun drink. Yeah. But I guess that's part of the thing. They don't want to coloring in, probably. Yeah, I guess. Okay. It's all well shook up. I just got to put it in the fridge. <laughs> So another interesting thing just happened to me just after I finished mixing that that pita light stuff I look over at the kitchen table and I see this there's a package for me that came in the mail this came from my cousin Jeff so I don't know what it is but I kind of thought hey I do package openings on the on the internet this is a perfect thing why don't I do it right maybe I should open it on here so I think I'll open it just to see what it is what Yeah. So, I'll open this right now. Hey, so I got this package right here. It came from my cousin. Let's, uh, let's open it. Let's see what happens. Let's see if I can open it with one hand. I have to get myself a uh, tripod because opening this with one hand. Well, I think I might have it. Oh, well, oh, I all that work and it's in another bag. Here. I'll help you. Okay. Well, how about, why don't you just hold it? So, you got me all in the shot and stuff? Yeah, even the messy table. Even the messy table. That's cool. Well, I could probably try to cut that out if you want. I never really done many zooms. I should try to start doing some of the zooms on the camera because mm. I haven't done any of that yet. So. All right. <gasps> what you get, what you get, what you get? Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, oh, there's a card for Eva. Oh, nice. Eva. For Mom. Card for the Bex. Oh, and there's some CDs. So it's like a, it's a VCLT. I got a VCLT for my cousin Jeff. Yay. Sean Ashby. Is that the guy that... Sean Ashby played at their wedding. Yeah, that's what I thought. And he also plays with Sarah McLaughlin. And he did a, like a one-man show. And uh, this is pretty exciting though, so I'm going to uh, play these discs. I'm pretty excited. 
Or at least I'm assuming them for me. Maybe he wants to give one to each someone else. But I'm, I might be just a pig and keep them all for myself because no one else listens to CDs in this family. We are grateful for everyone who could share in our special day. Thanks so much for coming for the visit and your gift. Thanks for sharing in our special day. Oh, and then there's a picture of them at the wedding. Look at the love. Love. Look at the love. Sharing the love. Sharing love. Awesome. Not only am I having a video where I'm going to have the shits, this is also the shit too. So thanks, Jeff and Aria. Uh, or I should just say Oreo, because that's what I like calling you anyways. Because you hate it. But she's as sweet as a cookie. She is sweet as a cookie. That's why I call her Oreo. There you go. Hey, Gil, while I'm holding the camera, you should introduce the kitties. Oh, the kitties. Okay. This <gasps> one... This one is Marzipan. Say hi, Marzipan. Hello. Tweet. So this oh, one's you Marzipan. Know? And then... There's her sister, Shyla. Say hi, Shyla. Look at the camera. Look at the camera. There we go. <laughs> Cuteness factor, a million. Those are my kitties. And now, I'm sure it's getting close to the time where I have to start drinking it. Okay, so one of the things I've noticed with this is that they have the fill line for the four liters. But I only have to drink two liters of it. And I want to make sure that I have it correct. So I measured how uh, full that gets with this glass here. And it just happens to be that this glass is perfect for 500 mils. So I will, uh, I will fill up this glass. And I have to drink four of these glasses tonight. And it will have for two hours. Within two hours, i got to drink four of these. So we'll see what happens. I don't think it's the first sip that bothers me as much as the thought of having to drink more of this. this with vodka. That'd be nice. Oh. Oh. Well, I'm on glass number two now. Okay, so I thought I'd come down here for I'm on glass number two right now, and I thought, well, I don't know. I, they say don't plan anything when you're drinking this stuff and uh, be close to a bathroom. So I thought, well, the best place to be would be in my room here, because just around the corner there's a bathroom, so just in case I you know, need to boogie, I can. This stuff is good. Like I said... I'm juicing this for all what it's worth because, like, it's a lot of money. So, anyway, since you saw those three CDs that I showed you earlier, and these are these are CDs that I got uh, from my cousin Jeff and uh, Aria. Thank you very much, guys. Like, I'm really stoked to listen to these. And over here, I picked up Foo Fighters in your honor. It's pretty good. It's a two disc set. I like how he he put the two discs together. But the one disc is is really rocking, and the other one's like laid back and kind of like slower. 
So just because of that, I'll end up listening to the more rockin' one more, simply because I like that one more. The slower one's okay, but so I think I think I might have preferred it if he kind of mixed the two together because I probably would have experienced it more. But um, anyway, so far I, I'll have to see. That's like that's just first impressions, right? I got this one a little while ago. Uh, this one, of course, everybody knows this album by now, but uh, it was uh, Chris at Dixieland Farms who introduced this one to me because uh, he was listening to it a lot, and um, I almost bought it on record because it was like 24 bucks or whatever. I thought it was a decent price, but there's so much low end in this recording. I kind of thought, but no, I think I'll get it on CD. If I see the record again for cheap, I might get it just to see, but I don't think it will be as good because with the way this is produced, it's such a, there's so much low end and there's so much high. It's a really awesome dynamic range on this recording. And I think that's why I really like it. You know, say what you want about this album or, you know, whether it's popular or it's bad. Uh, I really like it. I think it's awesome. So, and then uh, since I was at uh, Dweezil Zappa, I ended up getting his most recent studio recording via Zamata. I think that's how it's pronounced. Uh, they were selling it at the show, and of course, it was autographed. Um, didn't get a chance to uh, see him. They, you know, uh, like when I saw him 10 years ago, it was cool because I got to meet him, got a picture with him, and he autographed my jersey and so forth. And, and that was fantastic. But this one, it didn't work out that way. But Nonetheless, the show was fantastic. I love the show. I'm happy my kids got to see him, and uh, my kids love the show. So it was a, it was a great, fantastic show. So if you ever get a chance to see Dweezil Zappa, uh, it's as close as you'll ever get to seeing Frank Zappa. You know, and it was a, the show was stellar, just stellar. As you can tell, I'm really enjoying this. Anyways, I'm almost done glass two. Well, maybe not almost. I got a quarter away as well. Let's just let's just finish it off. Yeah, it gradually gets worse, I think. Yeah. Halfway. I'm halfway. Halfway. No, sorry. I'm a quarter of the way there. I'm halfway for tonight. So another one to do. So. <clears throat> so it's going to be glass number three, and I haven't hit the bathroom yet, so we'll see what happens. So, uh, this is glass three right now, and I kind of thought, well, after my first bathroom trip that I just had, that's, and that was a pretty big one, uh, we'll, I guess we'll see how this continues on. So, I'm just sitting here on the computer here and working on this video, the first bit of this video that I just transferred over, so... So I'll uh, I'll continue continue that and keep on drinking this and we'll I'll keep you updated. We'll see what happens. When I get this one done and I go to glass four, maybe I'll show some of the records or something. So the time is slipping through my fingers here. It's already eight thirty nine. It means I have twenty minutes left to finish. 
class four, and I not even finished class three. It was taking me longer to do this one, so I gotta polish this off and uh, get up to fourth class and drink that faster. Just before this, I had a bathroom trip number two. So, it wasn't as bad as the first bathroom trip, so I think they're going to get a little easier. <clears throat> but, one more left for the night, so, thank God. Four glasses, two liters total. Done for the night. Thank God. Now I just gotta wake up in the morning, do it all over again. So maybe I'll just end this video right here. Make a second one for the next time because I'm sure this one will be long enough. So, Gil, thanks for hanging out. This was my and, video. Uh, yes, it was. Tune into like the it, second video up, later on. That's great. To see how we make out I'm Gil, in the morning. That was Catch you on the flip side. Sure. <clears throat> if you didn't like it, watch, it. Yeah, watch something else. <clears throat>